Good people of YouTube, my name is Spanner and welcome to episode 41 of my Valkyria Chronicles series. Last time we did the extra DLC episodes, this time we will continue the main story. We're in chapter 16, The Maiden's Shield, so let's check out the first episode here, the Marmota. I assume it's a very large tank. Oh, and we only have one battle, though. If I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's check this out. Yeah, that's pretty big. Not quite a tank, or like a land ship. <laughs> the Clodin Wildwood is but a tender flower patch before the Marmota. Your Grace, a massive explosion was reported at the Citadel at Girlandio, sir. Our rear guard and Galia's primary force were both caught in the blast and obliterated. I see. And Selvaria has performed her duty. Now nothing remains to stay our hand. Continue the march to the Gallian capital. Okay, those were two um two episodes there. So operate in maiden shield. Then, then we got a bonus one, and then our mission. Curious to see how we're going to stop that thing. The Empire's ultimate weapon passed unhindered through the thick of Cloden's woods, said to be impenetrable to all but bird and beast, and continued its juggernaut march north towards the gates of Castle Randgris. Leaving the former site of the Citadel at Girlendio behind, the militia raced to the capital's southern gates to intercept it. Everyone, we've received intelligence on the weapon coming through Cloden's forest. The report identifies it as one of their most tightly guarded development projects. It closely matches plans for a terrestrial dreadnought, Marmota. It's heavily armored and carries a host of large caliber cannons. A battleship on legs. Leave it to the imps. It's one ridiculous take after the other from these people. Furthermore, it is likely that Maximilian is aboard the Marmota in person. Are you serious? How do you get there so quickly? Regardless, we need to stop that thing, or the capital will be in danger. Oh sure, just gotta stop it. It's a battleship, boss. How are we gonna stop it? We'll be cooperating with the Randgrees Royal Guard in effecting Operation Maiden's Shield. Our job is to lure the Marmota into a canyon the Guard has lined with mines. Beyond the mines, they'll be concentrating all of their firepower to stop it. Leading it into a minefield, huh? So we're the bait. Unfortunately, yes. With Galia's army vaporized, this plan is our only real option. Once they get out on open land, there's no stopping them. It has to happen in that gully. A land dreadnought. I still can't even imagine. Welcome. Alicia, what's wrong? You look kind of down. It's nothing. I'm fine. Now let's go beat us up a battleship. Okay, why would they even take the bait, though? I mean, they're a huge, impenetrable dreadnought. Why, why would they go after the militia into a trap and not just continue towards the city? I guess we'll see. 
Cordelius Stand. Highness, the Empire's dreadnought approaches at great speed. Thank you. The Royal Guard and Militia were deployed in a tandem operation, but the outlook is grim. We understand. We shall join them on the field. Fetch here the Royal Armament and tell the Castle Guard to assemble outside. Your Highness, where do you intend to go? I cannot idly sit atop a throne while the nation crumbles around me. It is the office of the Archduke's duty to fight for the safety of its people. Ah, yes, but that would be inconvenient, Highness. I ask you, make no foolish choices. Borg, what is the meaning of this? You are a precious bargaining chip, allowed. It would not do to allow you to simply leave. Bargaining chip? You plan to sell our nation to the Empire, then? Perish the thought, dear Prince. Gallia is about to be reborn a new child as a glorious kingdom with me as its king. <laughs> Damn it, Borg. I guess we'll have to deal with that later. Okay, time for action. We're about to commence Operation Maiden's Shield, together with the Rand Gris Royal Guard. Squad 7 will begin the operation from this position. The Marmota will approach from the north end of the area, advancing southwards at every turn. It will head along this route, trying to direct its path. Your mission is to lead it to this location, where the Rangri's royal guards and a field full of mines await it. Oh, so I guess we're changing, we're perhaps changing the path to force it to go that way, not, not necessarily serving as the bait. I repeat, your objective is to lure the Marmota to the specified destination. Anyone or anything caught in the path of its advance will be out instantly, you'll have no chance to call for a medic. Plan your tactics carefully. I know you can do this without any casualties, Lieutenant. Okay, we'll get Alicia. I think we'll get a bunch of scouts. Actually, I think I gave Melville some stuff. And we'll get Rosie. Largo for command points. Actually, let's get Nadine over there instead. I don't think snipers will be of any use here. Letting the enemy past here means allowing them into the capital. That must be avoided at any cost. Good luck. We have to divert that monster away from the capital. Oh, the squad seven, move out! It's right behind us. So that's it, huh? They weren't kidding with that battleship stuff. Remember, our mission's just to lead it along. Avoid combat where you can. And don't forget to keep your distance. Get run over by that thing and it's all over. Maybe less troops would be ideal. Well, I guess they do have some... There are some enemies here. Okay, let's scout ahead. Let's get the scales in Galia's favor. So that way is closed off. I guess. And there is... A guy there. A guy that lived.
I guess I pretty much have to move everyone, huh? Right, here I go. Yeah, less troops would have been ideal, perhaps. Really? I see one. Oh, there's another one there. A lancer. Do not harm my people. It's too dangerous to stand near it. I'll have to move my tanks and everyone else. How much um, the Mar motor will advance? On my way. Let's move everyone. <laughs> Must be my lucky day. Maybe only scouts would have been fine. But I still have the tanks that I need to get. That I need to take care of. Leave it to me. Why do we, do we even have tanks for this? Just watch this. This is like a mission that should be done fast. So our guys can't get caught by the enemy. Wow, I have just enough command points to move everyone. Maybe we can divert some of our guys to the to the right there, into that closed off area. Let's see what happens now. They have a lancer. They had a lancer. And here comes the Marmota. But won't the person setting them off also get caught in the rock slide? They're shock-sensitive time bombs. Once you arm them with a shot, there's still time. Shoot them, then pull out before they go off. Their range is wide though, so be careful. Oh, enemy long range. <laughs> okay, have a lot of mortars in here. So I guess those bombs are what I saw over here. Yeah, that thing, the Ragna crates. We'll detonate them with one of the tanks, perhaps. There's another one. There are several more there. Yeah, I guess we'll have to do it to prevent the um, the Marmota from taking that that route. Did you just miss? Please don't let it reach Rangreen. 
You did. Leave it to me. I equipped the Shamrock with the flamethrower, so it's completely useless in this mission. Get out of here. Enemy attack. All units brace for it. Let's see how that rock slide works. My turn, okay? We'll send Alicia over here to make some more rock slides in this area. Later, though. Right, here I go. And let's see. Okay, there's another one there. This place is full. It's filled with mines. How am I supposed to get through here? Guess we'll find out later. On my way. Stay sharp out there. Focus. This works for now. Let's see what happens. There's a rock slide. What does it do exactly? There aren't really any enemies. the marmota what does it do with the rock slides absolutely nothing they've stopped in front of the rock oh they've stopped slide. great it worked that should buy us some time okay but what do I do here I have to lead them past this area but how do I get across my turn okay and let's shoot the other one too I assume I have to do this to make okay. to make sure they don't go down this path or some stuff like that. Okay, let's move. I don't suppose these are friendly mines. Leave it 
to me. Let's break those uh, things in front so our tanks can go through there. Oh yeah, the tanks can go through there and blow up all the anti-personnel mines. That's a thing that can be done. Slow and steady, we'll get there. Alright, Marmota, what will you do this turn? Sir, the Marmota is on the move again. That was fast. Everybody, stay sharp out there. There's a fork in the gully. The straight path leads away from our target. We need to make them turn. In that case, why not use the explosives on the straight path to block it with debris? Already ahead of you, Kreese. Right. Good plan. Let's give it a try. A bit late, though. How about some mentions to all of these mines? Alright, Shamrock. Let's go. Still some anti-tank ones. Actually, found the use for the flamethrower. Am I out of the range? No. Okay, I guess removing the shamrock twice. Path is clear. Here we go. Let's move the slower guys first. We'll be there in a minute. Hold out till then. I think I'm out of the mortar. Yes, out of the mortar explosion. The Edelweiss is kind of in the way.